Welcome, Welcome back to the PDSG TV. And today we'll be reviewing Proactive Plus products. <laughs> The reason why we are reviewing Proactive is because we've been using it for six months and I'm just going to share a little story of mine regarding why I went into Proactive. So, I've been battling with acne for a very long time and um, I decided to actually try this product because why? I've been hearing about Proactive, I've seen it on the TV, I've seen ads about this product. It was expensive. So yeah, it was expensive. Right. So I was thinking, yeah, exactly. That probably because it's an expensive product, probably it would work on my skin. But I'm not gonna lie. If you're black, please go and search <laughs> on YouTube if black people actually use the product. I was watching the ad on TV. The ad on TV had a, a Caucasian woman. The, the products that work on them, on Caucasian people, it's not the same products that work on. Uh, dark skin people you get what I mean so because most times it's like that I was just saying the truth most times it's more probably yes I'm just saying out of experience because I know that growing up the cream I've, I used was different from the cream my classmates used when they were small so period period sound cliche but same I've been battling with acne like since when I was I think like a teenager or so on yeah like I think high school stuff yeah I was battling with acne but it is like a miracle happened when I went back to, when I went to college my skin was clear I actually have a video so I think if I got it I'm gonna show you guys I had the video it was perfect yeah guys uh, after my A levels I had like a massive break out of acne and my skin wouldn't just recover like then I started digging searching for information to be honest, she's the one searching for information, I'm the one just applying the products. Yes, because I'll search for information that she'll be like, oh, is it working? Because when I bought this Proactive, she's like, oh, is it working? Actually, I'm like, I don't know, I just bought it, but I've been researching and she's like, I'm going to buy it as well. The day after, this she bought me. it. Him. I went to a book and buy it. Yeah, it all 50 quid. I was crying, guys. 50 quid. And prior to that, I, I bought the proactive toner because I was like, before I actually buy the box, yeah, let me try one of their products and see if it actually works on me. Now, how much was the toner? 25 quid, 25 pounds, guys. For something <laughs> this in total, I've spent like 75 pounds of proactive yeah, just for my skin, yeah, guys. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, they say that do exercise, I'm all for that. Eat healthy, I'm part of 100%. that. 100%. But then I was like, my skin is still playing me some dirty games. I need to understand what's going on with my skin. So, yes. So, basically, Proactive comes in a box with three products the Skin Smoothing Exfoliator. So, this product is very good. I love This is my favorite product so far, not even the toner. And the toner was not bad as well because the toner helped my chin area. Because my chin area is so that I used to just get breakouts for no reason. Mm -hmm. This is my like my favorite so far because it was so good. I used it money and night and it was and it washed my face perfectly. It was just the best. Yeah, I would recommend it as well. I think that this is the best one out of the other two they have. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the three. So it's for Gator twice a day, morning and evening. Yeah, I did. And yeah, I think that this is my I think it's my favorite one out of them all and it's also my favorite one because it lasts 12 months I think this one was actually working well the first No, I think it worked well like throughout the six months I think so yeah Step 2 is the pore targeting treatment and it's a facial cream with salicylic uh, salicy acid Yes, I think so That's how you say it yes. Salicylic acid and it's a 16 ml product as you can see so after using the um, facial exfoliator you need to use the pore targeting treatment mm -hmm. and I think it was to minimize the size of your pores right? yes and then you also to target the acne like to reduce the size of the acne yeah like if you know when your acne is getting bigger when you put this on it actually makes it to reduce inflammation it reduces inflammation and stuff like that Mm, no, then it was not working. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they actually said that he does, but yeah, I used this for six months. No, it wasn't working then. Because mm. all my days, I remember that when I had like a massive one, like yeah, it wasn't to reducing it, it was just there, giving me addict and addict and addict and addict. Mm. 
no i'm sorry this wasn't working at all for all six months this wasn't working it, this kind of worked but this was kind of very slow it mm. worked but it was slow because if it's working then you're not supposed to see a uh, breakout on your cheek anymore because i used to put it on my cheek area and mm. all but then i still see sometimes some breakout there but i was like ah, it's not supposed to like that's the place i really get the breakout like cheek area chin area sometimes yeah my t-zone as well like it's something i need to really work on as well my t-zone so i was like this is so annoying so yeah i was like it's not really like if I'm scale to from zero to ten, this is like a four point five okay. of working. I would give this a one. One to six, so four point five one. Oh yeah guys, going back to this one. Oh yeah. This one was a ten. Okay. For me this is a ten. I would give this a eight. Yes. The last uh, product on this line is the Complexion Perfecting Hydrate uh, This is a facial moisturizer For me, it didn't really make a difference because First of all, my skin is never on dry skin, I've got oily skin It wasn't really making any difference to my face It was, it's just what it is So for me, this one, I'm sorry, it's a zero Because I didn't even finish it It's still, I still have some product and I, I could actually open it there So I didn't want to see it <laughs> Guys, we actually come here to do a review after six months of using Proactive. Yeah. And this is, this didn't make a difference for me. Mm -hmm. It didn't make a difference for me. Have you heard of the healing book? Log on to www.pdsgtv.com. It's available now on the website. Don't miss out and grab your copy. We have come to the end of the video. We reviewed Proactive Plus and we have come here and given our honest review of what we think about Proactive Plus on dark skin. Because mm -hmm. we actually think that we need more products that actually work well on dark skin. Yeah, they need to focus. Yeah, on dark skin as well. Because we, we get a lot of hyperpigmentation, yeah. a lot of blemishes that actually get darker. Obviously. And they don't want to disappear. Yes, That's and then, the problem. Exactly, and is that whenever I used the the like the three products at the end of the using the three products you have to use a sunscreen oh yeah an spf yeah. 30 like a good spf to protect yourself from the uv rays when you go outside if you have any products that you can recommend or whatever just like leave it down in the comment section just tell us what you think about it have you ever tried proactive do you think it works because mm -hmm. if it works we'd like to know like what it actually does on your skin because being dark we'd like to know mm -hmm. on dark skin how it works maybe ours is just like a different case or it's just out of the norm that's yeah, not exactly working. it's just out of the norm we don't yeah. know because so we're open to trying obviously and thanks for watching see you on our next video and remember to like comment and share and subscribe, subscribe. see you in the next one bye, bye.